I have found a way to not get followed in the grocery store while I'm shopping for food to survive so I won't starve to death because I'm not eating because I don't want to go to the store because I'm getting followed around. So what I do is I go to the store, regular shopping, and I just say hi to every employee. I spark up, hey John, yeah, all right, you need some help over there? Oh, I'm just joking. I'm shopping. I'm shopping. Hey Julie. Hey, can I get a sample of that turkey? <laughs> All right. All right. Hey, hey, Fred. How you doing? Yeah, it's me again. Oh, you have, you say, thank you. Thank because you knew I was coming. Thank you for this. All right. So I make myself apparent and visible and known when I go shopping. There'll be no more people following me around. I do not like to be followed around. You can tell when somebody's following you. Because when you look at them, they turn around and they start to pay attention to the most ridiculous item in the store on the shelf. They're not paying attention to that item. They don't even know how much it is or what they're looking at. Their peripheral is on moi. So no more following me around because I'm introducing myself to everybody at the grocery store. Bob, John, Julie, Jake, Chris, John, Eric, John again, John again, everybody. No more following me around. I've got this lick, you son of a piece of mother. This flower is so delicious. I just can't believe it. Have you smelled this flower? It's so serious. I'm so serious. This flower is absolutely amazing. Hey, cool. What's up, cool? What you want, blue? Huh? What's up, cool? Huh? What's up, cook? What's up, cook? If you are one of the many people with an identity crisis, well, this video is for you. I can't help you. I can't even lead you or direct you to where help could possibly be. All I can do is point out the fact that you have an identity crisis. Hey, how you doing? I heard you had a cold. You're not doing too well, huh? You got the sniffles, the, the runny nose, the cough, the achy head, chest hurts. This is what I advise. I think you should get a uh, poquito uh, lemon. Poquito lemon. Uh, maybe you should also get, I would suggest, a little cilantro. Maybe you want to get some cilantro. A uh, poquito lemon. Mm, muy bueno. That's what I really recommend, is that you get some lemon, some cilantro, and then... <sighs> really, that's what I really suggest. Who are you, El Guapo? <laughs> El Guapo. Who has an identity crisis out there? Who don't know who they are? Who's not being themselves? Who's unoriginal? Who's a bandwagoneer? Be you. Don't be me. Don't be them. Don't be us. Don't be a uh, group or uh, singles. Just be you. If you're goofy, well, guess what? Be the goofy you you are. Only one person's gonna be that goofy you. You. Huh. Who would have thought? Basic. This is basic, easy. Teaching the humans of the earth. <laughs> Does that mean I'm an alien? I think I might be an alien. I think. Just in case I am an alien, I'm gonna try to make contact. Just, I wanna holler at my family up there, you know. I, I'm sure I got some brothers and sisters and 
Ah, I can't wait to get out to space, Mars and Jupiter and undiscovered planets. Anyway, if you have an identity crisis and you feel someone you know may have an identity crisis, point them to this video. You hear that? It's UPS. I thought it was a spaceship from Jupiter coming down to say, hey, come back home, little guy. I just cured baldness. I, I have hair. This is, look what you did. My peoples of the, of the, no, not the heavens. A little bit past the heavens, I would think, over uh, the space. No, no, is it, is it like uh, sky, cloud, heaven, space, or is heaven beyond? Uh, look, uh, my hair, my hair. Thank you. Who was it up there? Was it one of you crazy green alien family members of mine? Thank you for watching The Daily Boogie. I would like you to like this. Put some comments down in the talk box. My hat, my hat is hot. My hat is hot. And when you're done doing that, perhaps you'd like to do a little thing I like to call subscribe.